Control variables are factors in an experiment that are kept constant to ensure that only the independent variable is affecting the results. In scientific research, experiments are designed to test the relationship between an independent variable, which is changed, and a dependent variable, which is measured. However, other factors could also influence the outcome, making it difficult to determine the true effect of the independent variable. By keeping certain conditions the same, researchers can isolate the relationship they are studying. Control variables help improve the reliability of an experiment by preventing outside influences from distorting the results. Now let's look at the purpose of control variables. The main purpose of control variables is to maintain consistency and accuracy in an experiment. If multiple factors change at the same time, it becomes unclear which one is responsible for any observed differences. By holding certain conditions steady, researchers can confidently attribute changes in the dependent variable to the independent variable rather than outside influences. This makes experiments more valid and their conclusions more trustworthy. Without control variables, results could be unreliable, leading to incorrect conclusions or making it difficult to replicate the study. By reducing unwanted variation, control variables ensure that experiments produce meaningful and scientifically sound results. Now let's look at some examples of control variables in experiments. Control variables appear in many types of experiments. In a study measuring how different amounts of sunlight affect plant growth, factors like soil type, water levels and temperature should be kept constant to ensure that only the amount of sunlight is influencing the results. In a medical study testing the effects of a new medicine, researchers might control variables such as the age, diet and activity levels of participants so that these factors do not affect the outcome. Even in physics experiments, factors like air resistance, pressure or humidity may need to be controlled to prevent them from influencing results. By carefully selecting and maintaining control variables, scientists can ensure that their experiments produce accurate and reliable data. Now let's compare control variables with independent variables. Control variables and independent variables serve different roles in an experiment. The independent variable is what the researcher intentionally changes to observe its effect on the dependent variable. In contrast, control variables are factors that remain unchanged to ensure the experiment is fair. For example, in an experiment testing how temperature affects the dissolving rate of sugar, the temperature of the water would be the independent variable, while factors like the type of sugar, the amount of water, and the stirring method would be control variables. Without control variables, the experiment could be influenced by unintended factors, making it harder to determine the true relationship between the independent and dependent variables.